Hello and welcome to this quick peek video today with Hot Docs looking at how you can use e-signature tools with the Hot Docs technology. And I'm going to take you through the process of selecting a template, filling in an interview, creating a document and then sending that document off to be signed. So as I do that, I'm going to come into Hot Docs and click create document. And I'm going to select the template I want to create. And this is a standard customer contract. And I'm going to give the contract a name. I'm also going to give it a reference so I can find it later on. And now once I've given it a reference, I'm going to click go to interview. And Hot Docs will go off and get all the questions I need to answer to produce this document. So I'm going to give the, the name Graham Smith, who's responsible for issuing this contract, fill in and answer all the questions, all the usual Hot Docs technology that you expect. Questions appearing and disappearing depending on how you've answered the previous questions. Building that document in the background. But to avoid boredom, I'm going to click Fill Demo Answers. And we'll skip to the customer contract information. Now, for this demo, I'm going to change the customer contact to me so I can send an email to myself to be signed. So I'll change the customer contact name to Graham Penman and my email address. And then I'll click Finish. And Hot Docs, in the background, takes all that data and it pushes it into the template and produces a document which will open up in Word. Just a standard Word document with all the data and all the right places, with all the right styling and formatting, cross-references, table of contents updated. With all the customer contact information and a signature block, most importantly, for the customer to sign. So what I can then do is click Send to DocuSign. And during that process, it is taking all the information that we've captured in the interview, the customer name, the customer contact details, and then it's feeding it into DocuSign along with the document that we created and assembled via Hot Docs. And now I'll jump into my email. Because my contact details were in there as the customer contact details, I've received an email from DocuSign. I can open up that email. I can click Review Document. And I'll be taken to the DocuSign site for me to be able to sign it. You'll see that this is exactly the same document that we produced in Hot Docs just a few seconds ago. You can click Continue and go down to the signing line. And now I can click on Sign and put my signature in there and click Finish. And that is the end-to-end -end process. Producing the document in Hot Docs via our Intelligent Assembly Engine, then pushing that document back into DocuSign and out for signature. Thank you for watching this quick peek video from Hot Docs.